Hey, how you doing? Joe Franco here. I wanted to do a quick video on Facebook's user IDs and where to find them and how to upload a list of them into into Facebook's ad manager for a custom audience so that you can set up marketing to go directly to them. So I just picked this random person, John Edward Luke, don't know him, whatever, uh, just to show you. First of all, to understand the, the, the uh, user IDs themselves and to see what is Facebook is using now, it's called Open Graph. You would go to anyone anyone's profile page and remove the www and type in graph, G-R-A-P-H, hit enter, and it'll update. And this is all public information, anybody that uses Facebook you know, agrees to to allow this is public information. Now, Facebook wants marketers to have these user IDs so that they can make money on advertising, obviously. So as you can see, John Luke, John Edward Luke here, his user ID is this number here. Also, they give you uh, the name, first, last, middle, the link to get to them directly, male, female, location, and the username that they use on Facebook. Because <clears throat> obviously there's more than one John Luke, so there's numbers and you know you know how all that works. So, but once you compile a list of these user IDs, UIDs as we call them, you go to Facebook and go to your ad manager, which we're gonna go to right here. Hopefully this speeds up a little bit. I just had to do a reboot. <clears throat> A lot of programs and things that I'm finding lately, um, as far as using with Facebook, a lot of them seem to work a lot better on Chrome. You know, a while ago it was Firefox, everything seemed to work better. But <clears throat> All right, once you get into your ad manager, you can go down here to Audiences. Click on that. It's going to bring up a page here any second. Where you can create custom audiences. Uh, it'll pop up here. You'll see I have quite a few of them already uploaded into into my ad manager. Uh, you want to go to this button up here. A green button says create audience. It's really simple. You want to save when you compile them, you want to put them into like a text file or something like that. Um, data file, custom audience. You'll also see that uh, you can also upload if you have an existing list of email addresses, even phone numbers, I believe here. Let's see. Uh, we'll get to that in a second. I already clicked on uh, choose select file. So I'm going to go to this. It is moving slow. If I can remember where I have it here. I'm going to upload this file here that is actually from uh, that I pulled for for a friend of mine who I went to school with, Mighty Spartans, MHS. As I was able to pull 4,719 user IDs associated with with our school. <clears throat> so I'm just going to select that, and I'm going to choose user IDs. Like I said, you can see here that. You can upload num phone numbers, mobile advertising, or email. We're using Facebook's own user IDs. Going to name this MHS. Alumni, you can put a description. Just hit create audience. That's uploading. And boom, 4,719 records have been added. And 
depending on the size of your list, it can take some time for it to populate. But in the meantime, you can go to uh, inside of your ad manager and you can start creating your ad. Um, and by the time you get it set up and submitted for approval, usually your audience is, is built by then. So that's how you you upload custom audiences into Facebook. I hope you found it useful. Look around, I'm sure you find some more videos here. I'm gonna be doing a bunch of them on various uh, uses of Facebook, fan pages, custom audiences, and likewise, subscribe to my page, my YouTube channel here, and uh, look for us at uh, Online Works on Facebook for plenty more. Have a great day.